Good morning, everybody. A beautiful greeting to you from up here on God's Hill. I want to talk to you about the shadow this morning. And uh, what I mean by the shadow is uh, I'm no psychologist, but the term comes out of Jungian psychology, Carl Jung, the Swiss psychologist. And he had a concept that there is a part of everybody's personality that is underdeveloped. And he called that the shadow. And uh, it may be something that you have ignored in your personality. It may be something that uh, you're good at, but you have suppressed it. Um, and uh, Jung thought if you were going to ever grow, that you needed to at least acknowledge that part of your personality, that part of yourself. So uh, for some people, they uh, the shadow stuff is stuff that's buried, uh, particularly unpleasant experiences in childhood. Uh, sometimes the shadow is um, your uh, what you think your weaknesses are. Maybe you feel like you're bad with finances. Maybe you feel like you are um, not a people person. There's all sorts of things that can be uh, in your shadow or part of your shadow. And uh, Jung said you had to make friends with that part of yourself, that you had to at least shake hands with it, in other words, um, to acknowledge that that too is part of you, even if you don't like it, even if it's something that you feel you need to work on, even if you feel like, even if I work on it, I'm never going to get any better with it. But there's also a positive side of the shadow. I think sometimes people hear the shadow thing and, and think that it's all negative. Um, but Jung also, I think, meant... Uh, that there could be a positive side to the shadow. And um, in this time of year, when there certainly is enough noise and enough decorations and people um, demanding that you be jolly, um, and when there's Christmas carols at the mall and at the hospital playing, being piped in, uh, what would it mean for you in this Advent time to sit with quiet? Maybe that's the shadow. Um, Maybe it's to pick up an old hobby that you uh, gave up years ago because uh, you thought, well, this is never going to lead anyplace. The shadow can have a positive impact and a positive aspect as well. And I would encourage you to think about that this Advent time. What is part of you that has been ignored or suppressed that is calling out to be born this Advent time? Take some time to think about that. Give yourself a few seconds, um, a few minutes even, um, and it's some quiet time today, maybe right before you fall asleep, and ask yourself, uh, what is it in me that needs more, uh, that I can give more to, that I can discover more about myself? And uh, I pray that you will find that a fruitful exploration and a fruitful journey. I know it has been for me, and it is for a lot of people. All right, we love you all and miss you all. Hope to see you soon. Blessings.